Table Ninja 2's Sit and Go Sensei will auto-register and seat you in PokerStars Sit and Goes. Once you've configured Sit and Go Sensei for the tourneys that you want to play, your focus can be concentrated on playing more Sit and Goes because registration and seating is all automated. We recommend that you always test Sit and Go Sensei first at Micro Stakes. We also recommend that you define within STARS your maximum buy-in and use the buy-in sorting tabs in STARS to prevent from accidentally buying in for stakes higher than intended. In this video, we're now going to show you how to configure Sit and Go Sensei for two different PokerStars Sit and Go registration filters. Then we will demonstrate how to perform a test in Sit and Go Sensei to ensure that the PokerStars registration and seating is completely automated for the two STARS lobby filters that we just set up in Sit and Go Sensei. First, we're going to open the Sit and Go Sensei window, and we're going to set up two different search names. The first one we're just going to call 10K. Using the plus sign on the right, we're going to add the option for a second search name, which we're going to call 20K. Notice that there are a couple of options here for each of these new search names that we didn't change the variables on. First, we're going to be using the EU version of PokerStar 7. And for each of these searches, we've designated a maximum of three Sit and Goes that we want to be seated in at the same time. Now we're going to return to the STARS lobby and set up a filter for all single table turbos that are considered low stakes. We're going to further filter the list of sit and goes that STARS returns to include only sit and goes with a 10 in the name. Returning to sit and go sensei, we are going to click save on the filter named 10K. In effect, we are telling sit and go sensei that anytime we want to use the Sit and Go Sensei search named 10K, it should recall exactly the filter currently displaying in the STARS lobby. Now we're going to set up a STARS lobby filter for what we want to search for when we use the Sit and Go Sensei search that we called 20K. We're now going to look for low stakes multi-table tournaments that have 20 in the name. Just like we did before, let's now go back to Sit and Go Sensei and save the search that we previously named 20K. The filters currently displaying in the STARS lobby will now be saved and used anytime we use the search we named 20K in Sit and Go Sensei. Now let's clear all of our non-game type filters in the STARS lobby and test to see if Sit and Go Sensei can recall the Sit and Go filters that we just saved. As we can see, Sit and Go Sensei has successfully saved and recalled two new favorite filters in the STARS lobby. Now we're ready to start the Sit and Go Sensei wizard. You'll run the wizard each time you're ready to use any of the Sit and Go Sensei searches that you previously configured and saved. The Sit and Go Sensei wizard is extremely simple. On each screen, just click continue when the button becomes active. As the saying goes, this is where the magic happens. Watch as Sit and Go sends registering us for Sit and Goes that match our searches and is seating us when a Sit and Go is available.